Hello, my name is Anna Primo. And my name is Sebastian Logwa. And today we're going to talk to you about basic aerodynamics and the controls of the plane. So basically there are four factors of flight. There's thrust, lift, and there's drag and weight. So thrust is caused by the motor in the plane and it makes the plane fly forward. And lift is the force that opposes gravity and it's mostly caused by the wings and without thrust there wouldn't be any lift because um, there wouldn't be enough air going over the wing and that one called it lift so um, and not the, then there we come to the drag drag is the opposite of thrust and it is the resistance of the body of the aircraft and what drag does, basically do, does is drag makes the plane fly slower and the last one is weight Weight is basically the weight of the plane, and the greater the weight is, um, the more lift there is required to make the plane be able to fly. So now we're going to show you a picture um, that sums up everything we just talked about, and to give you a visual picture of how the four factors look on paper. Now we're going to go into more detail on the factor of lift. Lift is mostly caused by the wings, as I already explained to you. And one of the main principles is the Bernoulli principle, which we are going to explain to you now. Okay. So, as we can see here, as we can see here, um, the air comes from here, and this is the wing flying forward, and the air comes from here, and the air travels a longer way here than it does here, because there's a curve here. So, um, the air has to be faster on the upper side of the wing than on the underside and that, this creates a low pressure zone which creates lift. This is the Bernoulli's principle. Now to the controls of the plane, the functions of a plane. Um, to show this we need a plane here, so... Okay, so now we have a plane and um, so... Sebastian, um, what are the functions? What functions do we have? So, at the front here we have the aileron. This is this function. So, show it to the camera. Like this. Okay. The this aileron. Is the aileron. <laughs> yeah. And what this, what this does is basically um, it lets the plane roll on its own axis. So, like this it would, it would uh, roll to the left. And like this to the right. A roll would roll on its own axis because because um, the the air if I have it like this the air comes from here pushes this side down and, and would pushes like this, this side up and, and that's why it would roll like this. Now what other controls do we have? We have the elevator back here. The elevator. The elevator. Like this. The elevator. And what this, what this control does, it, it lets you fly up and down cause, and it does this because if it's like this and the air goes over the elevator, it pushes the rudder down and it pushes the tail down, that means the front of the nose, the nose goes up and that means that, that makes the plane fly upward and the same with the, when you go down. And at the back here we have the rudder, this is the rudder. And it makes you fly. And the rudder um, gives you yaw control. And many people won't know what the what yaw is. So Sebastian, show them what yaw is. Yaw is, a, is um, yaw is this. Like this. Okay. This is yaw. Oh yeah, yeah, that, 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 that. So show it. That's yaw. And that's the yaw control. So these are the functions of a plane. Yeah. So um, thank you for listening. We hope you liked the video and we hope you learned something from it. Yeah. And uh, actually this video is based on a video from Flight Test which is called Basic Aerodynamics. Um, we're gonna have the link in the description below. And um, please check it out because that's a video where it really has a lot of information. You're gonna, you're gonna find really much information there. We just summed a bit of the information up. And uh, yeah, um, thanks for watching and please subscribe.